Hey guys, my name is Sanjay Raj. As you guys know, due to the coronavirus, everyone's at home. And as this video is dedicated to developers, I wanted to show you guys the best coding projects that you guys can build while in home. So as you guys know, everyone's at home, so everyone wants to be productive, improve their skill levels. So this is a project video on what are the best projects. I will be breaking this down into simple, advanced and intermediate. I'm sorry, I told that the other way around. But you guys will be able to implement these ideas in your projects as well. This can help you increase your skills and also put in your resume and increase your portfolio level low. So without getting like talking too much, let's get started. So the first thing is I'm, I'm going to be dividing this into two parts, which is going to be app development and web development. So for app, I, I will be focusing more on Android than on iOS because I have I do not have that much of experience on uh, iOS development so yeah also web development as you guys know I've uploaded some pro projects I will leave that in the description as well but I will also be focusing on some main projects that you guys have to build so the projects that we want to get started with in the Android section the app development section is an e-commerce app e-commerce app is one of the like important apps that you have to build if you are starting or getting started with android development i know android development is not like web development it's kind of complex uh, this uh, the stuff in web development cannot be implemented in app development it's really hard uh, app development is kind of uh, hard but if you do e-commerce apps you guys will be able to understand stuff like database management sections and stylings and uh, casting and activities uh, intents a lot of stuff i itself learned a little bit uh, just by uh, making normal apps this uh, which brings me to my second one which is to understand basic functionalities you guys can build normal projects uh, such as a currency converter or api handling such as uh, using java kotlin on the android side and swift for the ios side so currency converter and api handling are not the best uh, apps but api handling such as google maps api can help you increase uh, can help you kind of understand how android app uh, making works and also the third one i would like to recommend and i would like to recommend this and i want you guys to do this before doing uh, both of those projects sorry both of the first ones which is e-commerce and logical functionalities app uh, which is to build an agency app so kind of like building a clone of uber or instagram which is going to be complex but will be uh, like a learning curve or something so in the web development side the first thing i have is to build a fully fledged web app by including database functionalities such as uh, building a blog app which is basic app a blog app using php on the front end uh, no php on the back end as well and database management which uh, also makes you learn a little bit of html css and javascript I also posted a video series on how to create a blog app using PHP and MySQL database. If you are inter interested, I'll leave a link to it in the description. But regardless, oh, like learning the functionalities of a database can also help. And also you guys can learn this for free in websites such as Pluralsight. They have given free month access to everyone because of this uh, virus. Which brings me to my second point, uh, to start building a portfolio. To start being a portfolio for yourself, or even if you do have a portfolio, just try to imp improve it. Uh, try to implement the new 2020 web de design styles and stuff. I do not have that much to talk on portfolio, which brings me to my third one, which is API handling. As you guys know, previously I uploaded a video, I think uh, two videos back, I uploaded a video on how to use Fetch API in JavaScript, which is really basic. But if you have been in the programming space for quite a while, uh, you guys know the handling APIs can get really complex, such as using uh, React uh, in the React in the front end and stuff. So there's a lot to API handling. And also, if you want to get started with the basics, I also have a lot of videos on how to use APIs and some different APIs, such as Google Books API and stuff. So I'll leave a link to it in the description down below those are some of the basic stuff basic uh, projects that i have for you guys if you didn't find this that much helpful and uh, didn't find that much of projects that you guys want to learn i'll leave a link to 
one of the videos of Tech with Tim. He uploaded an awesome video on uh, what are the best projects to do. So if you guys are interested, I'll leave a link to it in the description as well. So that's it, guys. So use this time to learn projects, uh, programming, new programming techniques and languages. Um, so those stuff. As you guys might know, we crossed over 100 subscribers at this time of recording. I hit 112 subscribers. So if you guys are new and stick until the end of the video to learn something valuable or I hope you guys got something valuable and also we crossed 100 subscribers I'm hoping to get uh, at least 200 uh, by the end of this month or by the end of next month so if you guys are new I want you guys to subscribe to my channel and uh, that's it guys uh, I'll see you guys in the next video peace